Hello and Happy New Year to our client community. Over the Christmas break, I thought we might mix things up a little this year and introduce some video logs amongst our regular blogs that we release. Instead of overthinking it, I thought I'd just get on the bike and produce a vlog and work on the theory that the more you produce, the more effective they become. So bear with me. Here we go. I've chosen a very simple yet powerful topic to cover in this vlog based around the concept of compounding returns and time. Albert Einstein referred to this deceptively simple concept of compounding return as the greatest discovery, mathematical discovery of all time. In simple terms, it works like this. You earn some interest on your savings in the first year, you then take that interest and you put it with your savings. In the following year, you earn some interest on the savings and the previous year's interest. You then take that interest and you put it with your savings. In the following year, you then earn some interest on your savings and the collective total of all the previous year's interest. And you put the interest with the savings and so on and so forth. So let's see the magic at work. Let's say two individuals wanted to invest to build a nest egg for when they turn 60. They both have a risk capacity to implement a broadly diversified high growth portfolio and for the period of their investment are able to achieve an annualised portfolio return of 9% per annum with annualised volatility, i.e. standard deviation, of 12%. Let's consider individual one, the early bird. They save $6,000 per annum for 10 years from age 22 and then just leave their savings grow and reinvest the annual returns right through until age 60. Individual two, however, waits until age 30 to commence a savings plan of $6,000 per annum, but continues this savings plan right through until age 60, reinvesting the annual returns from the commencement. Let's recap on what you have just observed. The early bird contributes $60,000 over 10 years. Individual two contributes $180,000 over 30 years. End result, the early bird is still in front by around $120,000 at age 60. Imagine if early bird continued their RSP beyond age 32. And that's the power of time and compounding returns. As clients, you will likely have a good grasp on this concept and even experience the benefits of compounding returns over time. So this vlog may just serve as a refresher and a pat on the back for taking action early. Or it might be a good opportunity to share the vlog with your children or people you care about. Or it could be a good prompt for you to review your savings capacity and think about that dream or goal that you never thought was reachable and make a start now. I'm Paul Shepherd. Thanks for watching.